Hey guys, we're back. We're working on a first hacker rank, me and Mustafa. Hey, what's up? What's up, yeah, man? Absolutely. Okay, bro, it's so hacker. what are we seeing here? Yeah, so bro, it's actually a hacker rank, and we have taken a decision that we'll be working on the algorithm on the basis. One algorithm each day. Awesome. So here's the first challenge, bro. So it's saying your first challenge. Go, bro, go ahead and read it up. Okay, so this is an introductory challenge. So it's the first one, and we're going to work on the hanker rate coding environment. So what they're asking us is to complete the function solve me first to compute the sum of two integers. So exactly. solve me first. Okay. And there, what, what were we giving, Mustafa? We're giving the... So yeah, so here, here's mm -hmm. the two variables right over here in the main function. It's saying it's a variable A and variable B. Okay? And it's a real line. That means it's taking an input, right? And it's taking the input and it's converting the input into the number, okay? Because it's doing this. Parse int. That means it's converting into the number. Uh, it doesn't matter you're providing a string. Likewise, you're providing one, two, three in the string. And this function will convert this into the number, okay? Okay. So, yeah. So, it's passing. It's saving into the two numbers. And it's saying you have to return the sum in this function like this. So what we have over here, we have two sample inputs. It's two and three. And if we plus them, it will be equals to five. Right? Right. So, yeah. So let's get into it. So if you see over here, nothing. Everything is, the code is already here. If you see this. Okay. Yes, yeah, so they're saying this type return A plus B. So guys, this is a global variable, right? And this are called as local variable. Okay. Okay? Yeah, because this is a parameter, sorry. This is a parameter, it's not a local variable. So yeah, these are parameters. That means you are passing these values inside the function. And you will be returning those values like this. Oh, damn. Man, it's not working again. Guys, no worries. Yeah, A plus B, and that's it. You'll be returning. So what it's saying? Oh, we have to remove this. Thing. What? Okay. So now it's saying that you have to suppose we A is equal to two and B equals to three over here, right over here. See, okay. it's taking that, and then it is, and then it is, it is passing inside the function in the parameters a and b and over here we are catching the parameters and we are just returning the sum of these two variables and here it is the result and let's see yeah for test the code we just have to run the code okay, okay. awesome yeah. It's, yeah it's running let's see oh awesome that's the first one and yeah one way i guess um to look at it too in that question is just look what they're asking for. I guess we're going to the next. Oh, it's asking us where we're at. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, yeah. Yeah, bro, go ahead. Oh, no, no, go for it, go for it. You, you can pick student, I guess, so we get more questions. Yeah, yeah, we're not professionals, we're students, <laughs> okay. <laughs> uh, oh, damn, bro. They're asking about. Okay, to be honest, I'm graduating to be. There you go, dude. Go for it. Yes. I'm in the same year, bro. Proceed up here. Okay, so here it is. So problem solving is here. So we'll be continuing this problem. Awesome. And something you got to realize about the last one is the trick was what is parse integer? What are they asking for? And if you don't know that part, just look it up. And that's basically changing the function, uh, changing a string and re getting return an integer. So that's exactly. basically what it's doing. So just remember, if you, if you just look at what they're adding and try to guess, okay, what what do they want me to do? We'll we'll keep doing yeah. this on the next one. Exactly. And one more thing. It's just a type pass. That's it. The Correct. parse in is just doing a type pass. That's it. So 